Hey guys, it's Jared from Pop Rap here with Kim and Khloe Kardashian talking all about season four of their amazing show, whether they thought they'd ever get to this point, and what you can expect to see, some slaps are involved. Check it out. When you guys started this four years ago, did you ever anticipate that we would be at this point where you would still be documenting your lives? No, I mean, I honestly, I think we get surprised by even the fact that we have fans. Like, I think we're just we're like, oh my God, you watch the show, you're into it. Like, it's, it's really flattering. It's just a blessing that people are so into it. What do you think it is about your family that sort of transcends that typical reality show? I think people can relate. There's so many of us, and at least someone could relate to one of us. And that just makes people feel like that they have that connection, so they want to continuously watch, because it's either an outlet for them if they don't have brothers and sisters. Oh, they could dream, and this is how their family would be. But there's so many people that come up to us that are like, my family is so crazy, just like yours. So I think someone can relate. We're the modern day someone. Brady Bunch. <laughs> oh yeah, we are, yeah. Now, with season four, you know, there's been little previews out, and it seems that a lot of the beginning is gonna be about getting Scott back into the family. I mean, you actually slap him in one of the first episodes. Twice. Slap him twice. <laughs> Tell me, were you the most hard on him coming back? I just think I was in such shock and I was the one that, I had like a front row seat to everything and I was like, it just seems so ironic that you're here and now she's pregnant and this and that. I just thought it was so much going on for me to understand so soon. And I just- I think Chloe just took it the hardest for sure. I did. And so I reacted not the most ideal way. You know, between Playboy and the PETA ads, you guys have become like flat out sex symbols over the last four years. Is that Sexy. weird? I, I personally do not think of myself as a sex symbol, but it's definitely flattering. I don't flattering either. To no. hear no. that. What is flattering? For I mean, sure. is, does, does it change it. the way when you see people looking at you? Do you have that moment of like, oh, they maybe have seen me naked? No, <laughs> no I never thought that. I think because we have so many brothers and sisters, so, like girls, we There's all like walk no privacy. Girls. Yeah, you don't have privacy having so that many brothers and sisters. Got it. And, that, and that's just what you do. So I'm comfortable in my own skin. So when I did the PETA campaign, mm -hmm. I was just comfortable doing it. Right. So I'm just not used to really having a door shut. Yeah. <laughs>